welcome to Ascoli Piceno. The city is famous for the unforgettable Piazza del Popolo, the heart of the city, for its 100 towers and for the historical stratification of the urban layout. But maybe not everybody knows that the city preserves a unique treasure of science, arts and ancient handicraft jobs. It's the Popper Paper Mill, a fascinating complex of buildings. Here you'll discover the ancient way to produce the paper, but not only these. Today, in the renovated buildings of the mill, there is a center of scientific and industrial culture. Once there were the millstone, the hammer and the pools, powered in the works by the driving force of the river's water. Let's go in the mill to discover the secrets of the ancient handicraft jobs. The artistic estate was founded in the Middle Ages. At first it was only a mill. The notary's deeds of that period certify that mills for the grinding of the grain had been working in this area of the Castellano River since the 18th century. The paper mills are dated instead to the 13th century. The expansion of the factory, the restoration and the enlargement of its premises were due to Pope Giulio della Rovere who gave the mill its current structure. The mill works with the moving power of water used for starting up each kind of machinery. A system of canals, tanks and weirs conveys the water collected from the upper side of the paper mill to the mill, starting it up. Then the water flows again downhill to the river. Water is the most important element and the first energetic resource used by every activity in the mill. It supplies energy for milling wheat, paper production, uh, iron work and olive oil press. Here you can see the reconstruction of the machinery used for century to the paper production. Besides the direct observation of the place and the machinery, to imagine and understand the production process, you can follow a multimedia itinerary. Pictures, videos, sounds illustrate how the water reflew into the buildings, retelling us the story of the mill and of the people working in it. Reminds and reconstruction of Porta Cartara milestones are displayed on the first floor. This simple and modest room is very important because it reminds us the hard work of the people to make a living. We are now arrived in the third floor, in the scientific area, especially important for nature and mineral lovers. Here you can find the collection of Antonio Orsini, a scholar and a pharmacist from Ascoli. His ghost seems to appear here at night. <laughs> Mr. and Ghost apart, the collection is composed by tens of thousands of minerals, shell and fossil finds and a rich herbarium. Water, nature, science mystery, man, his activity, hard work, all that you can find in the pop-up paper mill, one world with many others inside. Don't miss this unique itinerary, a voyage into the ancient and the craft, a scientific discovery of the properties of the water and an exploration through the natural world, all in the same time. Don't miss the pop-up paper mill. <laughs> Greetings from Ascoli.